Hello, welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we will discuss about designation of Ukraine and Afghanistan for temporary protected status, TPS, for 18 months. If you are new on our channel, please consider subscribing, so that you get notification each time we upload a new video. Let's get started, but we will begin with Afghanistan. The Department of Homeland Security DHS, today announced the designation of Afghanistan for Temporary Protected Status TPS, for 18 months. Only individuals who are already residing in the United States as of March 15, 2022, will be eligible for TPS. This TPS designation will help to protect Afghan nationals who have already been living in the United States from returning to unsafe conditions, said Secretary Alejandro N. Mayorkas. Under this designation, TPS will also provide additional protections and assurances to trusted partners and vulnerable Afghans who supported the U.S. military, diplomatic, and humanitarian missions in Afghanistan over the last 20 years. Secretary Mayorkas is designating Afghanistan for TPS on the statutory basis of ongoing armed conflict and extraordinary and temporary conditions that prevent the country's nationals from returning in safety. Armed conflict that poses a serious threat to the safety of returning nationals is ongoing in Afghanistan as the Taliban seeks to impose control in all areas of the country and Islamic State Khorasan ISK, conducts attacks against civilians extraordinary and temporary conditions that further prevent nationals from returning in safety include a collapsing public sector, a worsening economic crisis, drought, food and water insecurity, lack of access to healthcare, internal displacement, human rights abuses and repression by the Taliban, destruction of infrastructure, and increasing criminality. Most Afghan nationals who arrived as part of the evacuation effort were paroled into the United States on a case-by-case -case basis for humanitarian reasons for a period of two years and will receive work authorization. These individuals may also be eligible for TPS. Additional information about registering for TPS can be found at Temporary Protected Status USCIS website. TPS will apply only to those individuals who are already residing in the United States as of March 15, 2022, and meet all other requirements, including undergoing security and background checks. Those who attempt to travel to the United States after March 15, 2022, will not be eligible for TPS. The 18-month designation of TPS for Afghanistan will go into effect on the publication date of the forthcoming Federal Register Notice. The Federal Register Notice will provide instructions for applying for TPS and an employment authorization document. Now let's talk about Ukraine. The Department of Homeland Security DHS, on March 3, 2022 announced the designation of Ukraine for temporary protected status TPS, for 18 months. Russia's premeditated and unprovoked attack on Ukraine has resulted in an ongoing war, senseless violence, and Ukrainians forced to seek refuge in other countries, said Secretary Alejandro N. Mayorkas. In these extraordinary times, we will continue to offer our support and protection to Ukrainian nationals in the United States. A country may be designated for TPS when conditions in the country fall into one or more of the three statutory bases for designation ongoing armed conflict, environmental disasters, or extraordinary and temporary conditions. This designation is based on both ongoing armed conflict and extraordinary and temporary conditions in Ukraine that prevent Ukrainian nationals and those of no nationality who last habitually resided in Ukraine from returning to Ukraine safely. These conditions result from the full-scale Russian military invasion into Ukraine, which marks the largest conventional military action in Europe since World War II. This invasion has caused a humanitarian crisis with significant numbers of individuals fleeing and damage to civilian infrastructure that has left nearly a million individuals without electricity or water or access to food, basic supplies, shelter, and emergency medical services. Individuals eligible for TPS under this designation must have continuously resided in the United States since March 1, 2022. Individuals who attempt to travel to the United States after March 1, 2022, will not be eligible for TPS. Ukraine's 18-month designation will go into effect on the publication date of the forthcoming Federal Register Notice. The Federal Register Notice will provide instructions for applying for TPS and an employment authorization document, EAD. TPS applicants must meet all eligibility requirements and undergo security and background checks. This is the end of today's video. Remember to subscribe to our channel, like and share the video. Until next time.